What's up, y'all? We are live back in the Boom Boom Room on Live Hip Hop Daily. I'm your host, Miss Lola. And I'm your girl, Sue Young. And we got our special guest, Young Bo, finally here in the Boom Boom Room. In the Boom Boom Room, y'all. Exclusive. How are you doing? I'm fine. How about yourself? I'm doing awesome. We're glad that you're finally here in the Boom Boom Room. You know, we had everybody waiting for a little while. But we are glad you are here. (laughs) What you got going on? Uh, Working on my music. You know, just dropped my single, Paper Good. I happened to actually listen to that song. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know what to expect at first, but when I heard it, I actually loved it. So, you know, um, what made you, what inspired you to write that song? Everything around me. Um, the song is really basically a feel good song. Okay. So it's like. Is it kind of uh, self-explanatory? Basically. Okay. You know, um, it's a money motivated song. Make you want to get up and go do something with your life. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. That's how I felt when I heard it. In yeah. the beginning, I was like, okay. Yeah. Paper good. It's riding. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Damn, this nigga, he getting money. I got to get up and go. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, stop wasting time. I was talking to someone about that today. Like, you know, we are, how old are you, by the way? I'm 26. 26. Okay. okay. Well, we are on the same age. I'm okay. 25. Okay. I was telling my little brother, like, you know, if we think about all the time that we wasted, up until now, it seems like we wasted a lot. Well, not can't speak for y'all, but for me and him, as far as our music, we wasted a lot of time playing around. But, you know, we can't, you got to just not pay, just chase the paper. You chase the pr- the purpose, and the purpose is going to lead you to the paper. Yeah. So, you know, you know, we got to. So, gotta, is that your, pur- your purpose is to what, make good music? What is it? What is it for you? Uh, my purpose is really to be successful. Okay. Well, it is. <laughs> what do you define as success- successful? Um. Well, you don't want for nothing. Uh, what makes it your family straight and everybody around you is taken care of. So you feel like because a lot like of people don't have that yeah. same definition for yeah. successful. Everybody they think it's has more a different materialist. definition yeah. for success. Mm-hmm. You could be a millionaire for success. Like as you said right here, you can have you make sure your family's straight. Make sure you've done it, taking care of everything you wanted to take care of as far as what you dreamed of and what you thought of in the past. You've taken care of that because you are successful. It could just be because you gave the people what they was asking for mm-hmm. or what they were looking for. That could be success in in its own t- as well. I agree. So success is definitely defined as different. It could be different for everybody. I agree. So we definitely love your music. What else you What else you got going on? Do you have any kind of promotions or anything going on? Uh, earlier this year I dropped a song with Trinidad James called Mink Coat. Okay. And basically, we are prepping for my uh, next tape, original, drop in December. Now, Paper Good, is that just the name of the song, or is yeah. that the name of that? The it's the name of the, the song. song. Okay, the song. Okay. Yeah. So, what is the name of the the album that it's on? Uh, original. Original. Yeah. Okay. Okay. What made you, what made you name it original? Uh, basically, I'm just going back to my old roots, like when I first started rapping. Okay. The, the type of sound that the, that the uh, whole EP is going to be on is that type of stuff that like stuff that I grew up off of, stuff that it made me want to write, right. you know, different stuff like that. Because okay. nowadays, the whole industry has changed dramatically and pretty quick, which is the type of music that's out now. Like, Definitely. it's a it's a total different sound from you know what I would consider a certain kind of music that I grew up on. Right. You know, it's it's just it's not original anymore. It's not original. <laughs> it's not original. It's original. It's not so original. you know, just like I was hearing. Someone saying uh, Drake didn't write his stuff and all this craziness. What you think no, about nowadays, that? it's just like. What you think about Meg Mill saying? I thought it was cool. I thought it was cool. What happened? No, I don't know, man. I don't know. 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 I I mean, just, okay, just how about you put yourself, these are your shoes. Mm-hmm. You got a homeboy. He kick it with you. Y'all write, y'all write songs together. Y'all kick it. Y'all hang out. Y'all made, y'all had, you know, sex with mm-hmm. same girl. It <laughs> 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 ain't what it is. <laughs> and you say, and he says on social media, you do not write your own stuff. Like, how would how would you take how would you take how would you feel about that? Would you just be like, all right? Nah, I wouldn't say. That. I mean, I wouldn't react on social media. You know what I mean? Uh, if that's your homeboy, like you said, that's your homeboy. You better call him up. Be like, bro, what's going on? Yeah, I mean, you, you hit him up. You don't you don't air nobody. Out. You don't air your homeboy. Out. If right. that's your homeboy, unless that's your homeboy. apparently there wasn't. Money. They was exactly. never. They was never shooting. They was the same never gym. cool. Yeah, Definitely I mean, exactly. wasn't. So. Drake has made like so many songs for this situation. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me he did. Because he do rap about everything that, know he, yourself. that goes on. Yeah. Did he not say know yourself? That was one of his songs. I'm sure he was really, really <laughs> prepared for this situation. Right? <laughs> so he was so prepared. Is it true though? I mean, I mean, 
I don't think nothing wrong with having a songwriter though, because a lot of people in the game have. It's really not. Why is everybody I mean, trying to knock that? Like everybody can't come up with the. Pro- you can have the love for what you want to do. Yeah. But it's other people that love what you do and want to assist you yeah. and are better at, at at writing music than you are. But yeah. guess what? Guess what's selling? They ain't talking about who writing the music, because obviously we don't know them. None of them people who wrote the song. All we know is the people who who's branding the song. Yeah. Nicki Minaj, Meek Mill, Drake, Lil Wayne, Beyonce. Berman. We only we, that's what I hear that Beyonce is taking credit for a lot of songs she never about, even wrote. Exactly. You know? Nobody's talking about the people who wrote the song. Everybody's talking about who's branding the song, and that's the people who's on the album cover. Nobody cares about that. So you're right. I mean, in a sense, it doesn't make sense to be like, oh yeah, he don't even write his own song. Oh, and then the, like comedy, like deaf comedy, just oh he don't write his own songs like. Okay, well, we're cares? glad that you're bringing back to the game <laughs> originality. originality. Yeah, originality. Thank yeah. you. You know, we need that, it, I, and I hope that real hip hop music, R and B, comes back because to me, that's the only real R and B that I listen to. Yeah, real R, the hip hop I listen to, the real rap that I yeah. listen to, is the original stuff. Yeah, because nowadays everything is just taken from somewhere, put their own type of little feel to it, jazz up just a tad bit, put it back out there, being able to mark it with a new face, and boom, there you go. You're a pop star. You're you're That's hot. Right. You're, this is you are talented. Right. Just, just off with it. Right. <laughs> Pretty much. So tell us who your who who are your favorite rappers or who are your favorite artists as a whole. Uh, you can name top five. It doesn't matter what order. Just top five. Yeah. Mm, that's kind of tough. Always hit, she always hit everybody with the top five up here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I got, a, I got a, few, a few. That ain't things. really no top. Top 20. You want to know of all time? <laughs> of all time? Uh, of all time, whoever you feel is, whoever you feel you listen to in the bubble bath, when you're in the car, when you're at your grandma's <laughs> house, whatever you feel. Uh, no particular order. Me? No particular order. Yeah, I would say... No um, uh, I'm a, a fan of T.I. Okay. Um, you kind of look like him. Uh, a little uh, bit. He uh, likes skin, you like skin. They all the same. That's, that's same about same. it. Same thing. <laughs> same shit. Everybody um, skin, they look all the same. I like Jay-Z. Uh, okay. Cameron. Look at Herb. Herb on the head. Yeah, look at Herb. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the uh, voice. <laughs> Andre 3000, and I okay, want to say yeah, uh, probably Lil Wayne. Okay. Yeah. Nice choice. So you don't, so so you you still you still like Lil Wayne? Yeah. You still love Lil Wayne? Yeah. You listen to his music? I got his last his last little free album. You did? Yeah. Little, little free album? Dang, that's a hate word. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got his last little free album. Look at that little chain he got on. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that little so no Kanye, no Young no Thug. Nothing. You don't like Young Thug? I mean, yeah. I- I mean, you gave him top five. There's only so much he can choose. <laughs> well, name a top yeah. twenty then. We on top twenty. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm kidding. Don't, I'm look, kidding. don't listen to her. <laughs> She's so silly. I'm just messing around with you. But that, I, that's I, a good top where, five though. Where exactly are you from? Because your your choice of music, yeah. you know, where you, where exactly? I'm from Atlanta. You from Atlanta? I'm from Atlanta. Okay. Yeah. Where from the west you, side. Where, what city were you born in? Were you were you yeah. Decatur? Where's Greater? Nah, or where? Uh uh-uh, uh. I'm from Atlanta. I'm from the west side. From the west side. Whistle. Yeah. Whistle. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so okay, okay. So hey. we are gonna go over there to your mom's house and we are gonna get some cornbread. Is that okay? Because we I mean, know she know how to cook. She don't step with her no more. She don't. Nah. She done moved out. She done moved don't out of the west side. I'm <laughs> just saying. I'm trying to eat. <laughs> yeah, she don't want nobody parking next to her. She don't want nobody walking Swear. by the car. <laughs> Brush against don't the car. Don't even look at the car. Don't even look at the rain guard on the car. You are so I'm slapping sorry. everybody. Please, um, I, w- I would tell you to tell everyone where they can find you at, you know what I'm saying, since you have your project coming out in December. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Where can they f- locate you at to hit you up to do some music, and where can they find your music at? Uh, everything, as far as me socially, is Yumbo 101, which is Y-O-U-N-G-B-O 101. Mm-hmm. And if you want to hear some more of my music, it's on my page on SoundCloud, which is also soundcloud.com slash Yumbo 101. Okay. Um, my YouTube, same thing. YouTube, Yumbo One Hundred and One, and I got some tapes on live mix tape, uh, three tapes to be exact. I need for you to introduce the song that we're about to go into. You know what I'm saying? Some motivation for y'all, you know, so y'all can get your Paper shit good. right. Yeah, yeah, Paper. yeah, yeah. This is my latest single I got out. It's called Paper Good. Hey man, go get your son. Hey, <laughs> stop playing. But it's nice to have you in the Boom Boom Room. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can find us at the Boom Boom Room 7 on Instagram. Our Facebook is what? Sue and Lola? 
on our Facebook. Yeah, because Sue and Lola, I did change our name. Because <laughs> it was just one name, Sue Evan. Right, and it everybody was like, was like, oh my God, Sue, we love you. Every, and me and her <laughs> is the same person. We don't look nothing alike. She's white. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> it's so silly. Y'all follow me on Instagram. Oh my God. SU3 underscore Y-U-N-G. Follow Mrs. Lola at Who Needs Them. Who Needs Them, y'all. Y'all definitely can go follow this young beau. At Young Bo, is it underscore one hundred and one? No, Young Bo one hundred and one. Young Bo one hundred and one. Y'all heard it first. We about to tune into that song. Y'all better listen to it. Uh, my credit bad. My bitch is even better. Talk bad about her, but can't even have her. What you talking about? Ain't about money, you don't even matter. Still keep it pimpin' like a player should. Hate how you want my paper good. 